Okay, hello everyone, and this is Miguel9398, and for today we're going to play Space Parkour, made by my good friend Victory Summary, so I'm gonna check and make sure everything's okay, and it seems everything's okay, we're going to play the game, Space Parkour, uh, September 7, 2014, made by a good friend called Victory Summary, if you know who he, uh, he is, He's the guy who made the treasure hunter map. So, yeah. Oh, whoa. What the fuck? Explosion! Alright. <laughs> of course, before that, I need to exit some of the programs because these kind of slows down the performance of my laptop. So, this one is for the server. Don't break the. I mean, here's the rules. Don't break the. Blo uh, don't break or place any blocks. Play in game mode 2, which. Adventure mode and also difficulty will be normal. So, ca uh, command block enable. You can use fly play in 1.8. Good luck and had fun. And if you are recording over YouTube, please give me a shout out. Map creator, victory summary, helper, super chilly. Is that? Oh shit! I really love these particles. Shit, man. Anyways, we're gonna do this shit. We're gonna do it. Checkpoint. We're gonna start, press me, press you, we you. Oh shoot, just, what the f Okay, let's start this motherfucker. Whoop, 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 whoop. This is so, oh shout. These are moving platforms. I love it. Okay, this, oh wait, what's this? Up. Oh shoot, I died. Ah. Whoop. Great. <laughs> Alright. One, two, three. Whoop. Oh, God. Uh, why am I... What, what, what? Okay. Bo -bo 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 -bo. Ah. This one, get the button here. Oh. But there's no button. Oh, so okay, I get it. So I need to place a button right here. That's great. All right, all right. Oh shit, 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 shit. Shop, shop. Okay, that's. Oh, oh. What the fuck? Even. You know, there's no button. I'm very sorry, Vic, but I'm using microphone 1.10. Uh, I think that explains a lot. Why? I want to see what's going on here. Okay. Oof. And also, I need some a lot. Of, I need a lot of steaks. Oops, wrong button. Because I'm kind of hungry and I don't want to die by hunger. So, game rule: keep inventory is true. Now, game mode two. Alright! Checkpoint reach, and I don't know what is this. Oh, wait. Ah! Fuck! Mate! Oh, so this is just a jump boost. I thought it's a trap or something. Oh, wait. One, two, three, one, two, three. Hey! Whoop! Shit. Mm. All right, all right, all right. One, two, three, hey, and eat. One, two, three, hey. Oh, shit. Oh, I press me. If you want to live. Oh God, this is getting a little bit difficult. But hey, hey, hey. Oh shit. I could just. Oh wait. Oh, clever, Vic. Clever. Uh, I cannot escape this shack hell anyways I'm trying my best poof one two three one two three hey one two three one two three ah shut okay 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 this is getting a little bit hard one two three one two three hey and uh, one two three one two three house ah, shut uh, what's with the delays man I can't do this shit with the delay 
Okay, I think three is all right because apparently I'm using Bandicam as a recorder, not Camtasia. And the reason why is because I don't want to, you know, um, mess up the um, the video because Camtasia uh, took the entire RAM. So yeah. Anyways, uh, since I'm kind of bored, let's try to talk about um, what just happened. Ah, oh, shoot! This is really difficult. So let's talk about what just happened on my channel, Zero H Minecraft. So apparently, um, I got a lot of dislikes. I mean, apparently the dislikes is way bigger than the li uh, the like system. I mean, apparently maybe because YouTube is totally broken and shit, and they just let um oh wait, and they just let fucking um bots to take over YouTube and try to remove you know the quality. I mean the the content of small youtubers so as a small youtuber who has only 2,000 subscribers uh, 2,000 is not enough for being popular on YouTube if you know that um, as a person who has 2,000 subscribers I feel the pain I I've been this crap before oh god the delays man I've been this crap before like I've been experiencing um, bad shit on my channel like back on 2013 I got a lot of dislikes <laughs> because apparently I become over drama on the server and since I did drama on the server a lot of people start to press the dislike button on, on my content every single video I had Shit. So, like I said, every single video I had, I got dislike uh, back in 2013. But now, apparently, in, on right now it's 2016. Uh, the dislikes are kind of getting worse. Like most of the dislikes came from people on my other channel because back then I'm oh yes I made it. Back then I made I messed up everything. Ah, oh, God. I messed up everything on Miguel 9398. Like for instance, I made a drama over semi community. Like say, oh look, DCMA. You know, it's really good that Exap really, really, you know, um, add this kind of uh, pa uh, Patreon serial code so that no uh, no leakers can leak. Um, fucking semi patron build and in the end it's going to be fucking outdated apparently many people hate what I did or uh, what I did back then like hey you're supporting DCMA and actually this kind of shit it's actually bad uh, as there's some girl I mean there's some woman that I just you know uh, heard I uh, saw her comment on the semi community she said that I'm making shit on uh, my Patreon page and I've been experiencing a lot of you know leaks on my creation but I'm fine am I upset no fucking way I'm not upset so yeah apparently there's some people who just really likes to uh, their build to be stolen by other people or maybe some doesn't want to but oh god like literally um, people kind of hate me <laughs> what, what I did there I mean like as I said earlier hey people there's some people kind of you know don't mind that their builds kind of leak because sometimes that when the time comes like um, some big company trying to uh, copyright claim the, uh, their creation they have to uh, they have leaks that you can just use like for example Pokemon Uranium Pokemon uh, Pokemon Uranium one of the biggest um, fame uh, famous on uh, unofficial uh, Pokemon uh, ROM hacks of black and white it got uh, terminated by Nintendo of America for no fucking reason at all man yeah it's really bad it's really that bad for um, these people worked on the ROM hack for nine years. Whoa, nine years? That's like before, way before Black and White even come up. 
maybe their concept was started on Hot Cold Soul Silver. So yeah, nine years. And later on, uh, suddenly, um, Nintendo of America started to fucking remove their ship. And how come people, you know, download the game since uh, the developers of Pokemon Uranium no longer, you know, show the download link? Well, there's some leaks um, on Pokemon um, Uranium builds. So, leaks are somehow good and bad. Like, they are like... 50% good and 50% bad. For instance, Pokemon Sun and Moon leaks. Um, at first, I never, you know, oh wait, I made it. Uh, at first, I never ever, you know, believe the Zygarde form back then. But then, apparently, it appears to be true. Com oh, I made it. Confirms true. Uh, since Zygarde forms are actually coming on Pokemon. Uh, Sun and Moon and Zygarde forms were actually real, so that's pretty pretty amazing back then. But anyways, moving on to my issue, my channel uh, about the dislikes and the hate bots and whatsoever. So as oh wait, uh, shit, this one's moving. This is gonna be a little difficult. Um. Um, since then, uh, since the dislikes, since the attack, and since the false copyright claims and copyright strikes I ever earned on my channel, literally there's some people who try to take down my YouTube channel because it's cancerous or it's fucking cringy. I mean, literally, seriously bro, you're trying to take down my channel because you fucking hate it? I mean, actually, it's called bullshit if you try to take down um, a huge uh, YouTube channel that would try to, you know, create its subscribers, trying to increase its channel since 2011. I mean, literally, Miguel 9398, my first channel, has been created back on 2011. Oh, God, this is really difficult, isn't it? Okay. Created back on 2011, and, you know... It's really bullshit to see many people say, fucking end this, because fuck your five year anniversary, fuck your videos, fuck your channel, fuck your life, kill yourself. Why don't you kill yourself? I mean, like, literally people are getting meaner and meaner right now. So, uh, after the incident back on May, um, back on May, earlier this year, early, early May, and the, yeah, somewhere there. Uh, my channel is kind of, you know, the other channel, Miguel92398, kind of, you know, improves its um, rating system, its reputation, and its subscri uh, subscribers. It's nearly close to 1,000 if I could, you know, confirm that. I mean, like, literally 720 is not close to 1,000. <laughs> like, yeah. Then upon that, uh, for the Rage Minecraft, my videos got really really get the hate like literally there's one person I found on YouTube and of course I'm gonna post it here on this video he said not to be rude but your content is really shitty I mean, it's really bad I'm sorry so anyways I know I'm my content is really bad and also I really know that many people you know get over Minecraft I mean, for a reason, um, Minecraft has been popular since 2011, and it's become cancerous on 2014 or 2015. So I, so I found my explanation why people got the hate is because it's Minecraft. People hate Minecraft now. Uh, oh, I made it. Now this one, I'm. Ah, uh, shit, fuck. So, yeah, man, back in the Minecraft server while I was playing uh, Mineplex, oh shit, nah, I saw some guy, um, when, not Mineplex, sorry, Minecade, I was playing Super Minecraft Maker, I was, it was after uh, making my um, video <coughs> on Super Minecraft Maker, and I saw some guy saying, The Rage Minecraft, this is a stupid name, this is a cringy name. 
and he started to laugh, uh, laugh out and, you know, uh, harassing my channel, harassing my name, and my username, actually, and harassing my reputation as well, like, oh, I mean, of course, people might think, oh, the Rage Minecraft, as if the person said he is a bad YouTuber, then I should follow what he said. He is a bad YouTuber because I kind of hate him for no reason. I mean, because I hate him because I follow that person who said, do not follow the Rage Minecraft because he is a cringe. He's a loser. Ah, oh, fuck. And of course, uh, some of you might gonna say, oh, look. Here's the Rage Minecraft recording shit again. I'm gonna dislike every uploaded videos he have until he start to say I quit YouTube. So actually, this part like saying I quit YouTube, uh, suggesting to make me forced to quit YouTube, it's called bullshit. I mean, what if you try to make a YouTube channel and then suddenly? all your years work on subscribers have been gone to waste how do you feel about that do you feel um happy glad that hey you know what i can admit that my channel is full of shit even though i wasted my uh, my i wasted i wasted my time trying to be popular for no fucking reason and why would i even need to why would I even need to make a fucking channel if I'm not really good at making videos? I mean, come on. It's actually bad though. I mean, like literally if you have like 1,000 subscribers and you finally, you know, uh, take that uh, milestone for nearly five years, it's, it's really good though to have I mean, it's really bad though to say goodbye to your 1,000 subscribers because you s start to say, I quit YouTube. So, yeah. My conclusion of this video, um, people are starting to be, uh, you know, play dumb. They are now turning dumb by just follow what uh, the other person said like hey don't follow him because he's a dick don't follow him because he's a jerk don't follow him because he's a total asshole who doesn't make good quality videos and only plays one game on his channel so actually this actually hurts my feelings I mean it really really hurts so much like why do you even say those words I mean did you say that on purpose or are you trying to troll me and you know try to test my social um, shit uh, try to test my social um, experience if I even had anxiety in fact I do have social anxiety I'm actually afraid if some people might gonna think oh if you don't post a video about um, apo uh, apolog uh, if you don't post a video, I'm going to start dislike your channel. Oh, you posted a video, I'm going to start, I'm still going to dislike your video. This is called social anxiety. And this kind of um, disorder on the uh, human brain, people are scared of what would happen to their lives. Like literally, I'm one of those victims who have those anxiety and... Uh, and, of, and also, yeah, it's pretty much it. I'm also, I'm one of those people who have those anxiety, who just, you know, being afraid to being, you know, uh, overtaken by other people, like, literally, um, cyberbullying or stuff. <sighs> so as I said, um, I've been working on this channel for nearly five years. The Rage Minecraft, actually. I've been working the Rage Minecraft for five years, and I got my first 1,000 subscribers on October 2015. Late 2015. Uh, and now, since you've tried to fuck up my channel and tried to mess things up, like, 
hey you know what it's nearly you finally got 1000 subscribers good the next thing you have to do is try to remove those five um, 1000 subscribers and stop making YouTube videos because you're starting to become a famous youtuber and I don't want you to do that so there's another uh, thing on people nowadays on the internet jealousy when they see someone uh, having a lot of popularity or a lot of good reputation jealousy strikes them and you know start to feel bad about those other people who became popular for instance PewDiePie which he actually mentioned that he already started his channel back um, and way back in 2011 and may, uh, trying to improve the channel it's really hard to do like it's really hard to you know to take care of the chat oh, crap 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 ah. it's really hard to take care of the channel since if you have issue uh, if you have a low subscribers I mean like literally PewDiePie started off as a Call of Duty player then Minecraft then Amnesia I mean Amnesia has become uh, the you know the popular thing on PewDiePie that's why he's become uh, famous because of Amnesia and his ju uh, jump scares okay same uh, not only on PewDiePie but, uh, also Smosh who's been on YouTube for since um, a year after YouTube ever exists it was around 2005 uh, oh god I and look what have they done they finally made their 10 year anniversary back uh, last year and also they're the second highest youtubers uh, on YouTube on uh, follow up PewDiePie as the first so yeah as I said um, people I mean youtubers have hard have a hard time making their channel you know great since the very beginning until the very end and also some of them might try to you know do some cringe worthy stuff but they're just actually joking but somehow people nowadays um, never understand a joke okay I'm finally made it uh, sure god damn it so yeah oh, I made it <laughs> took me a lot of tries but yeah I did make it okay one two three go ah fucking you know what screw it this is getting a little bit difficult I'm very sorry Vic I kind of cheated oh god this is really a hard jump what I tried to jump but then oof the ladder never okay so I'm confused <laughs> anyways as I was saying um trying to make channels are quite difficult though like literally difficult to do difficult to de uh, do so so yeah but anyways um about those people like uh, one thing I said um, before uh, in the beginning I said about anxiety which people have fears of um, being you know um, getting over uh, being uh, what's the term <laughs> I lost the term okay um, being over you know overpowered by other people over think by people who think that they're the best and you're not and you don't deserve to be a youtuber and the second thing I mentioned was um, jealousy people nowadays I'll get get the button here As I said, people nowadays have, um, okay, this is pretty interesting. People nowadays have this issue, an anxiety issue on fucking 
Oh wait, wait. Why am I saying anti? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, people nowadays still have jealousy. Like all, all they want is being a you a famous YouTuber like PewDiePie or Markiplier. But then since their subscribers are kind of low, they decide to dislike those YouTubers because they're actually jealous. But I kind of like this. It's pretty. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Okay, this is great. <laughs> Anyways, um then the third one that people uh had is um the third one that people had um about uh you know why they dislike uh channels is because they're just trolling around uh, okay I don't know where am I supposed to go so they love to troll people they love to play games play mind games to the people uh, oh so okay so they love to play mind games to those small youtubers like hey you don't deserve to have a subscriber and even though you have 1,000 or more than a thousand subscribers, you should end your channel because you finally finish. You finally getting 1,000. That's enough. Apparently, it's actually not enough. I mean, there's actually been there. I mean, trolling or playing pranks or playing uh, people uh, to other people is not actually only on the internet, but it happens uh, in the real world as well. Okay, so now I'm actually in the topic of reality, which people hate this topic so much. Like, they really hate reality so much. They, like, say, oh, I really hate the real world. I mean, they're like, oh, I really hate the real world. Why do you even talk about it? This is actually one of those issues uh, that people have. Um they hate um, reality there's the th uh, this is the fourth one trolling is the third one so they hate reality so the reason why they hate reality is probably because for one uh, they have um, poor life uh, lifestyle like they live in a poor family they live with a slow internet connection and number two they're always uh, they're always uh, they're always be the one who getting picked on in school like bullying or um, harassing which in the past it's actually kind of a big deal though but now since we're living in the future it's not a big deal I mean literally people don't care about these things anymore like when they uh, when people see um, Oh look, um, there's some kid who tries to, um, what's that, I kind of lost it because of the fucking lag in the smoke, okay, so, okay, now I remember, um, so like there's some, so there's some guy who would say, oh look, there's a kid who has, who lives in a poor family, a poor house, and who lives in a very poor lifestyle why does he even exist it's actually called bullying for a reason I don't know why there's smoke but I, it's pretty nifty so like I said um, it's pretty pretty hard for people who live in a very poor um, poor lifestyle and and since when they introduce the computer and the internet they will actually do what the bully do like they will start bullying harassing uh, small youtubers like saying oh look you have a very small youtuber I mean small subscribers <laughs> oh 34 subscribers you're not popular as PewDiePie I mean literally this is actually called bullshit because I really like this uh, it's actually called bullshit because uh, they're just calling you names like damn 
This is so great. Oh, beautiful. Okay, anyways. So, like I said, uh, this is actually bullshit for... Hello? Okay. So, I said this called... Oh, wait. Did, uh... Okay, never mind. So as I, as I was saying while I was distracted by the creeper, I thought I might gonna explode. This is actually uh, bullshit for them to do what the bully do and you know, um, trying to make a bully out of you. Um, yeah, yeah man, literally I've been there before, like literally I have I've been always picking on in the school, mostly in elementary and high school, for being different, for being uh, weird. But hey, the good news is that I still have friends to support me. So yeah, that's great. Not only from, uh, not only the internet friends, but real friends. Uh, I almost had a you know chance on a girl back then, but then I kind of I mean but then she kind of moved on to another person. So yeah, and like I said, I've been there before. I one of those victims who happened to have this kind of issue, like being picked on, being the third wheel of the group, or being the unpopular one so yeah this is really sad though because actually if you don't think that hey you know what this doesn't look bad it's actually part of growing up it's called bullshit though if you still think that people bullying you because you're acting weird and stuff it's called bullshit you, you don't have you don't have to say you know this is actually great let people you know bully you because because it's actually part of growing up later on in the future you will know how to fight for your own lives you will know how to oh god <laughs> you will know how to fight for your own lives know how to protect yourself and tnt okay and know how to be a man so yeah this is actually great but this is actually one of those issues that people never understand uh, till now from the very beginning till the end people never understand um, feelings so there so now I'm on number five of the, of the list number one is anxiety number two is fear number three is trolling number four is reality and number five is about um, what did I say? <laughs> Shit! I, oh god, I kind of forgot what did I, uh, I forgot what, uh, what did I say? I, because I was kind of distracted in playing Minecraft. <laughs> ah. Shit, man. Uh, I can't edit, I cannot stop the video and try to edit it. <laughs> I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. Uh, make the, uh, I can't do it though. Maybe I'll continue it once I finally reach to the end of this parkour. Not uh, might gonna do part two of it. Uh, it's actually thirty minutes. It's, ah shit! Close. I'm very close. So. <laughs> oh god! I kind of forgot number five. I'm not actually making the list though. I'm I'm starting to st I'm making it on my own mind. I express my own feelings. Oh wait, now I remember feelings. <laughs> okay. Ah oh, shit. So number five is feelings. So people have uh, there are some people who have feelings for other people. Like oh, I felt pity for you for your loss for what happened and, and other stuff and there's some who are being total jerks and say fuck that be a man don't cry like a baby like that really um this is one of those issues from from the beginning of time like during the caveman era the stone age where um even though there's no further proof of, of cavemen having those 
um, bad feelings of other pe uh, other cavemen. But yeah, it's actually a, a you know social. Uh, it's actually a part of the lives. I mean, part of our lives, like feelings. Shit. Yeah. Am I gonna end the video pretty soon? Because it's actually 30 fucking minutes. Uh, 35, actually. So, if I'm... If I don't reach to that part, how am I gonna end the video and continue it on part 2? <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, fuck. So, feelings. Number 5. People have feelings to other people, as I said earlier. And then there are some who don't... Who, who's being a jerk like they don't care about other people's feelings of their lives of their emotional feelings and stuff like oh look you're crying because your parents are dead a good thing that my mom and dad's still alive okay so uh on, from that uh like <sighs> It's called bullshit when pe some people try to, you know, mock the uh, the death of the, you know, person or loved ones. I mean, like literally, uh, I've been there before. Like, my great grandma died back on 2014, uh, heart old age. She was nearly 100 years old. Um, she died in a very, very tragic uh, car check arrest. She was the only uh, part of the family who st uh, she is the oldest of the family still alive <laughs> back then but it's actually sad to see oh shit you know what anyway guys and I need to finish this um, it's actually sad to see that my great grandma died on tragic arrest at a very near 100 years old so anyway guys that is all for today um, I have to end this because it's now 37 minutes. Um, thanks for watching. I hope you do enjoy it. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And also, try, try to express your feelings. How do you feel when you see someone who has dislikes? Do you feel like pity for that person who has number of dislikes for no other reason? Or do you feel, um, you know, uh, exaggerated? I mean excited I mean what's the term I forgot um, glad or happy for that person to have numbers of dislikes because he doesn't deserve okay I made it uh, because he doesn't deserve to be on the internet so are you one of these persons who feel that um, sickness anyway guys that's all for today um, thank you and goodbye